Hispanic Heritage is sponsored by Yellowstone Landscape and Honda Dealers of the Carolinas. This month, we are celebrating Hispanic heritage, honoring the contributions of Hispanic Americans to the culture, history, and achievements of the United States. Today, we introduce you to a Mexican American woman who has found a creative way to ensure a long celebrated coming of age tradition stays alive in the Low Country. Uh, this one here. Part stylist. It's more like a charro dress. Part organizer. And then we have the Tierra. Full time role model. Being Latina is an. It's a privilege, it's an honor, and it's something to be very proud of because no one can take that away from you. Diana Salazar Guzman has long supported Latino causes, encouraging voting, calling for immigration reform, and assisting families integrating in the low country. It's, everything's new. The language is new, the food is new, the school is new. That's why she embarked on a project to ensure a beloved Latino tradition that celebrates a woman's 15th birthday is still enjoyed in the country many Hispanic Americans now call home. As Latinas that we are, even as generations that we have been in this country, uh, we keep some culture in us. And that's something to be very proud of. Even though we are in America and we do um, get our education here and have some values that are Americans, but there's some values that never taken from your heart. A quinceañera, much like a debutante ball or sweet 16, can be very costly between the dresses, decorations, and dance classes. Salazar Guzman coordinates a free quinceañera made possible by donations, connecting with local high schools to find participants. What I try to incorporate is girls who are new to our country, um, girls who live in shelters um, or foster care, or with um, single moms or dads. Historically, the coming of age party has a big emphasis on community, family, and religion. Salazar Guzman says it's not for the faint of heart. It's just so much fun and nerve wracking. <laughs> and it's so tiring because you go from picking your dress to your tiara, to your shoes, to your tennis shoes, to your surprise dance, and you have to a uh, total different wardrobe. Work, she says, is all worth it on the big day. Unfortunately, because of the pandemic, this October's quinceañera has been canceled, but Salazar Guzman says she's hopeful for next year's celebrations. Stay with us. You're watching News 2 at 4 o'clock.